hi guys welcome to manual tutorial in this video i'll be teaching you how to clean your backdrop you can see um, the backdrop is very small so in the first part we'll be extending it to these directions we need to fill it we need to remove the books here so the first part will be extending the backdrop and the second part will be cleaning the backdrop you can see there is some wrinkles on the backdrop so we'll be doing it thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel so that i will be i will get more recommended on youtube so we will start by hitting on ctrl j on the keyboard you, on mac you have to use the command and j so we duplicate our picture let's come here and choose our lasso tool we are going to select the object okay so now the object is selected we'll come to select here and invest now come to edit and choose fail now in fail make sure the mode is normal and the opacity 100 percent and preserve transparency is unchecked and come to content here and choose content away and hit ok so you can see the extension has been done and uh, it's filled nicely so now we need to fix the background and so now we are going to select the object by coming here and click on quick selection tool I will be using the cloud detail results that give me nicer selections selection is done but it's not that good so we need to fix it you can use the plus button and the minus button here to fix it add and on add so we are fixing it So now the selection is done on part may not be selected so we need to expand it so we come to here which is a select and select modify and expand let's choose expansion of five apply effect at canvas on body on check so we hit on okay so now it is expanded what we'll do next is to hit on the control and j to duplicate so now we have our selection here very nicely so we need to separate the image from the background so that we can clean the background so hit on control and hold on the selection that we did here now come to selection again and choose inverse this time come to the layer one here come to the layer one here and hit on control and J to separate the image from the background now the separation is done here so we need to on the layer 3 we select it and come to filter come to blur and choose your Gaussian blur the radius depend on the image that you're using if the background is too dead you need to use a higher radius and if it's not other dead you need to use a, a reasonable radius to make your picture very nice so i'll be using 24.9 okay i'll hit ok now you can see the the background is very nice now so select the top one click on ctrl shift alt and e at the same time to duplicate the picture so now we need to delete the tray in the middle three layers in the middle so now you can see uh, this was before from extension to cleaning the background to to now thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel so that i'll be getting more recommended on youtube thanks for watching see you in my next video bye bye